ですね。Happy New Year to you, ladies and gentlemen. Happy New Year to you. Waluo mami, gova itaka kwenza. Ruchira basaija. Na mami, aine miaka asatu mwe asatu. Ava muhororo. Era muandi suwa vitabo. Kusinzi la address jetwina. Avele chisasi central. Muna kawa division. Wana muka ampala. Na mami ya kuati wa. Na inga ngaichimu vunana. Nti ya koze sa Twitter handle obo mukutugo gwa Twitter <coughs> ngena kuzo mweza abiri munya <coughs> navuma president ngamuvuma ngamuvuma ibigambo ebitasobana kuita mukama ko muntu yena mulabufu ge bigambo bibinyo Erati ya kuma kwecho, ngena kuzo mweza abiru mukaga. Eranga akoze sa Twitter yeye njini. Navuma, Lieutenant General Muhozi Kenerugaba. Eranga akoze sa hivigambo hivi vye nyo. E nyo, nti no muntu, o muntu unga ine mpisa, tasukuro kuwanga abidamu. Era, biliku mkutugwe, uguwa Twitter, Echi nchi chetu lavanti, chitu obola, edembe yomu nchi chinomu. Wovanga, tokiriza ganya na mfuga ya muntu, walu wa makubo mwoso ulo kubango mchale nji ingiramu. Hiranga wetu zetu lavabantu, wabadababia ufuza abamu, wabatakanya ne system, na inga wachale nji inga system nebogera, Na ya tevo, tebagenda paso na ukubanga bavuma. So, echikolo wachi wakufuma, mwoyita kumutimba gano. Chivinyo, ni mbu wanga wafi wano. Teri, a supporti inga chinti cha wakufuma. Era, ni mateka. Chirikiri ya ntipu wafuma, uvo zizo msango. So, umuami ono, Tukwe na kumuchaji nga umusangu kwa kufuma offensive communication. Nga guno umusangu mchitabo chiva ita Computer Mrs. Act echa mateka. Era encha kumachasa wa nyaja kuwanga tuwa liwa mkoti. Awa nene mene misangu. Tuwa gala kusawa na Uganda. Ntevi ntungevi unadalanga vitade kumukutu. Tembishere nga kuwanga atena awe. Kwa hizo ukuwanga na salu manyate ne vikutuwa lida mu. Era uh, fe tuja kusiga langa tuwiste de. Nga tula una network sizo na. Kasta wawa wawo munti ya nagwe wavuma. Report to ina competencies. Banda wantu wavuna na mateka nga wegara gira. Mweba lenyo and happy new year. Search. And uh, search was conducted with full knowledge of his lawyers. And uh, the narrative of human rights, I think uh, police, we are, we are very okay with observing human rights. Where, where there are instances of uh, violation, as you may want to call it, there must be a justification. Because you know Article 43 of the Constitution of the Republic of Uganda talks about the limitations of rights. Uh, the, 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 the rights have limitations. And even when you go and read the African Charter on Human Rights, Article 27, Subsection 2, it also talks about uh, the rights. When you are enjoying your rights, you should ensure that the rights of others are, are also observed. So there is no, there is no bad faith in having him uh, detained beyond 48 hours. No, the justification is there considering even that no other official uh, offices were working. His case required search, and search with a warrant, and which warrant must be issued by court. 
and uh, we have been in festive days. Courts have not been able to be accessed. But now everything has been done, such has been conducted, and we are now good to go. So there was nothing like abuse of, of his rights that was done in bad faith. Are you creating a debate of, 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 of lawyers who are activists? And you think uh, you'll get the facts? There has nothing like any torture at all. And uh, in case somebody thinks he was either psychologically or physically tortured, there are so many avenues of how he can bring it to the justice system. And I can guarantee you that if there are areas of torture, of course, which are not there, we have a robust system of how to address it. I have been seeing his Twitter uh, indicating that the man is vomiting, is, all those are lies, the man is very stable, and you will see him tomorrow in court. There is, no, any, there, there is nothing like torture, like somebody is trying to insinuate. It is not what it is ought to be. Anybody who commits an offense electronically without any legitimate purpose of communication commits an offense called offensive communication and it is provided for under the Computer Misuse Act. It does not matter on who has done it and when. And our system is non-discriminative but only that we cannot be everywhere to see who has committed what. That is why I want to appeal to you that in case you see such communication that are abusive in nature, it does not have to be against you. All offenses, all criminal cases are offenses against the state. So find comfort to report to us, either in confidence or direct, we shall proceed and apprehend the perpetrators. So if Stella Nyans has done the same, we haven't seen it, you can share with us and we see how we can proceed. It's a crime and it is prosecutable. And the good thing is that we have built a very formidable and proficient team at CID quarters, as well as a very good uh, uh, team of prosecutors at the Office of the Director of Public Prosecution. Thank you so much.